the following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Austin, Texas, the total non-stop action women's champion, Jordan Grace. This superstar always says there's nothing more important in the world than loyalty. Well, someone should tell him that this is WWE. Loyalty is the least valuable currency around here. I don't know how you can't be nervous when you are prepared for the match of your life against the greatest generational talent in women's division history. There are only three things certain in life. Death, taxes, and Charlotte Flair. She is inevitable. An entrance fit for a queen. And from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Hey, if you want to create a legacy in the WWE women's division, then Charlotte Flair is the mountain you have to climb. Yeah, there's no one even close to the amount of accomplishments that Charlotte has. The WWE ring is her unquestioned kingdom. Charlotte will stomp you and they'll leave an imprint of her boot tattooed on your face. Highly skilled in every facet. Strength, brawling ability, risk-taking, mind games. No other women's competitor has been so decorated, so revered. Charlotte Flair is ahead of her time. True greatness usually isn't realized until after you've been enshrined in the WWE Hall of Fame. Such is not the case with Charlotte. Just open your eyes and experience the greatness. Whether you like it or not, no one can measure up to Charlotte Flair. She was bred for this business and has become the absolute pinnacle. She really is the biggest challenge there is in this women's division. Reminder, the title is not being defended here as we have a women's champion that wants to blaze a trail in the division and who I believe has all the potential in the world. Oh, I couldn't have said it better myself. To blaze a trail, you need to have credibility. And the hardware she carries around her waist gives her just that. And Smart Money says she's nowhere near done yet. This match may well be a sign of things to come. The only question is which way it's going to go for her. But she's not taking on any ordinary opponent. Charlotte Flair is wrestling royalty. She's crowned herself as one of, if not the, greatest women's champion of all time. This division wouldn't be where it is today without the regal presence of Charlotte. No denying Charlotte's incredible abilities, but I would emphasize you correctly said crowned herself. Not everyone recognizes Charlotte as the queen. They just see her as someone who protects her own. Hoping to end it early. Charlotte gets the shoulder up. She came here to fight, not lay down. That looked devastating. Corey, what would you say Charlotte needs to do to come out on top tonight? If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Charlotte's accomplishments in WWE run a mile long, and that's because of everything she brings to the ring. Her athleticism, her nastiness, her aggression. She's always a dominant force because of those traits. She flips it back on her. Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. Sharp elbow. There are plenty of ways battling in this area could end in serious harm.
Charlotte clearly not thinking much of her opponent right here. And she was dangerously close to a countout. Uh-oh, Dragon Sleeper applying. This could be it. Oh, my. Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. Uh oh. Knees up. Got the knees up just in time. A flat out power into the scoop slam. Charlotte is losing grasp for this match now. Charlotte's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. Being carried around with ease. Planted face first. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, oh what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? And she goes for the pin. Fending off a two count there. Not yet. Lock it in, the Dragon Sleeper. She's in it. Showing the world just how much fight she's got left. Reciprocating the initial reversal. And Charlotte with the reversal. This is just establishing dominance, followed by the stomp. That offense really hitting her hard. Quickly, the cover. to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. And she's stunned in the corner. <laughs> she has her target weighed and measured. A cross body from the middle rope. A ferocious attack put on here by Flair. Such athleticism, nastiness, and aggression. Flair's trademark traits paying dividends tonight. Just like they always do. Is it enough? The cover! Two! Breaks the count. What does she have to do to put her away? I'm asking myself the same question. I have no idea. Ah, oh, Charlotte caught by the counter. out of the ring but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here oh dropping down all their weight these women have gone to all-out war in this match i don't see how they have anything left to give here and what a throw that was from behind german suplex she's in a dangerous spot and could lose this this has just been an absolute massacre. Charlotte needs to utilize some of that famous flair stamina to get back in this. I agree with you. All right, back to it, returning to the ring. Count out a minute. She needs to get back in. Oh, yeah, she is really getting fired up. Wow. Uh-oh, pump handle applied. What's coming next? Nelson Driver. That might topple the queen. Two. No, my, that was close. Charlotte knows she's in a fight now. That move only enraged her more. The queen's looking to make it. They're going to gun it. No way. No way. This is not going to be pretty. Will she take advantage? Pin! And that'll be it! Finally a victory! What a hard-fought win! Here is your winner, Jordan Grace! Charlotte forced to take the loss in this one.
a not so regal outcome for Charlotte. The queen deserves better. She'll get what's rightfully hers eventually.